Hello from Krakow, a mysterious abandoned city here in Basilicata, one of several ghost towns in Basilicata, but this is maybe the most famous and most touristy one. As you can see, this town has been completely abandoned due to earthquakes, and here, unlike other places, the county blocked the ways to go inside, and they're actually monetizing this with paid tours. The question is, will we be able to penetrate those fences and get inside? Only one way to find out. This town, as you can see, is completely, completely ruined. However, there is some life inside because I can smell horses or donkeys and I think some of the locals still keep a farm inside. The houses here are in extreme danger of collapsing. So even if I do get in, I do not intend to actually enter into one of those houses. Since it's November, there isn't anyone here. Apparently it's the least touristy time to come. Wow, guys, look at this place. Can you believe this place exists here in Italy? Only less than an hour from Matera, but I guess renovating it would be really, really, really expensive, huh? Look at the location of this place, guys. It sits on this hill overlooking the entire view of Basilicata, the beautiful, beautiful Basilicata. Look at this beautiful church up there in the bell tower. And just look at the view, this incredible view. I really do understand why they would settle here. Just look at this. Yeah, I think here is the main entrance point and the city did a good job blocking all around it. I really have doubts I'll be able to pass through here, but we will try. Just circle back but first. Let's see what's over there beyond the corner. Let's see what's up there. Maybe there's a way up through here. As you can see, I'm completely, completely by myself. But we have to check all the passages. What's the worst that can happen? I call a helicopter to recover me. Looks like a, an active farm. No, it looks like a dead end. Too steep. Oh no. Pasta. Wow, guys, look at this view. Isn't this amazing? I really, really doubt this will be my way through. I mean, we can try, but it doesn't look like it leads anywhere. Just don't see access from here. I think my best chances are to circle back and maybe try from the other side. You know, guys, if, even if I won't make it, this place is so beautiful, it doesn't really matter. It's about the journey, right? Okay, back to the other side. 
of Krakow. through for the entirety of my time. This place is absolutely forsaken. Okay, how do we get in here? Maybe through here. Whoever fortified this abandoned city did a good job. No cracks in Krakow. No pun intended. Let's see what's going on here. Here I can definitely pass. Right? Yeah. This is done. Let's see what's there. Lots of sheep poop. Step in it. It's almost mission impossible. Okay, we definitely get closer. Wow. Look at that. This is so pretty. Really fenced is good. Really good fencing right there. This is the last chance, guys. If this doesn't work, we're out of here. Oh. What is that? This is a, definitely an option. Not to get cut from this, then I'm inside. Okay, I think I made it in. Okay, I'm gonna stay as far away as I can from those buildings, though. Of course, this is locked. Strada Onorati. Okay. Let's move on. Hopefully, I won't get arrested by Italian police. Check this out, guys. A real apartment. I'm gonna go inside, but look at it. This being some kind of a huge stove here. So maybe a bakery or something. The reason I don't step inside is because you never know how strong the floor is. And the problem with those places is that sometimes there's a underground floor. And then what would happen is that you would fall. Isn't this beautiful, huh? Let's head down there because I think this is a dead end. So let's go right through there. The wind is shaking a gate there and it's so scary. It's very windy today. Wow. Would you look at that? Isn't it mesmerizing? I don't know who's the Italian who sits on the surveillance cameras. But hopefully he went to his lunch break or something. Shh. Oh, there are donkeys here. You think donkeys attack people, right? Worst comes to worst. I have an escape route through here. Ah, this leads back. It's a dead end, guys. Hello. Very cute. Very cute. So right there where the locked gate was is where our 
path should have continued inside. It's the only way in, basically. And it's so good, so well locked, there is no chance. So it looks like this is as close as we're gonna get to Krakow. I mean, you can get a guided tour, but that's not fun. I wanted to explore it by myself. I will leave a link down below how you can get a guided tour here. If uh, you ever come to the area, it is worth it. And you can see this amazing place from the inside. They take this tour really seriously, like they think you wear a helmet, stuff like that. You see, the path leads here and then up there through that locked gate, which we definitely can't get through. Those people, they thought about everything, didn't they? Even if you do, it's like escaping Alcatraz. But vice versa, I guess. Trying to sneak into Alcatraz. You see, this is the problematic gate, which we definitely, definitely can't pass. The only way inside, it's really heavily locked. I forgot to bring my chain cutter today. So, it is here. I will bid you goodbye. I hope you liked it. Um, yeah, it's been an adventure, right? I will leave you with some incredible drone footage of this place that I took just now. And I'll see you on the next video. And don't worry, we'll find that there's another abandoned village not far away. And we'll go and check it out. Ciao.